Hey, hey, hello, welcome on my channel, Triple Two Tarot, this is I'm back with another pick a card reading for all of you. And today's topic will be a message, call, email, or text is coming. Who someone wants to talk to you, or who wants to talk to you, and why? Why do they want to talk to you, and what is the message? What type of message or what type of, uh, you know, communication or conversation they want to have with you. So this could be anyone, platonic, friendship, romance, could be career. I don't know what will come in the reading. I just don't know anything. I just don't know anything, boo. So we will see that who wants to talk to you, who wants to communicate with you, who want to, um, if they will step up and what is their message. Because sometimes people just think about it in their head or they're manifesting it, but they don't step up. So we will see that if they will literally step up and tell you something or do something or take action or not. That's very important, the question. But we will see who is this person and why they want to talk to you and if they will step up or not. Okay, so that's going to be the reading of today. Please, it's a general reading. Take what resonates and leave the rest. You can also book a personal reading. Everything is given in my description box. You can reach out to me on my email address for more personal reading detail and bookings. You can also follow me on Instagram. Link is given below. Please do not get scammed. I will never ever contact you anywhere on social media. So be careful with the scammers and fake accounts. So let's start the reading. Um, you have the four letters, okay, with the heart crystal on it so choose intuitively whatever the group is calling you okay number one is this amethyst number two is a beautiful green color number three is a white and number three is this chocolate color heart choose intuitively this is a letters by the way i love that this is my new deck so we will see that who is this person and what do they want to talk to you and what is the situation and what they want to talk all about if they will step up or not so let's start reading please do not uh, forget to like share subscribe hit the notification bell and please also give me your feedback i will really appreciate it if you resonate with this energy and who is this person i will also love to know the story of yours or the situation that you're dealing with this person so let's go let's see it i'm also going to use maybe uh, letters of this person so this is going to make you more clear and more confirmed that who is this person let's go hello group number one welcome if you choose this amethyst crystal here this person could be pisces or um aquarius um, this could be also because if this is a stone of a healing, so there's something to, to do with the healing here. This is also something to do with the crystal stones or maybe if you have this type of a business or you're owner of some type of a spirituality business, then this could be a client. And others of you, I'm feeling this could be something healing situation between you and this person. But we will see. Uh, there's something about maybe a January and February, the month. You maybe met them or something happened or they want to heal the situation maybe in the month of January or February. Or, I don't know. Are they born into that? We will see who's this person. Yes of swords. Yes, it's about, uh, so whoever this is, they want to talk definitely with the Ace of Swords. This is about clarity. This is about truth. This is about communication. This person definitely by clear placement. They could, be into, they could be into technology or they could be into astronomy or stars. Could be in astrology. They could be into, um, what do they call? Physics, science. Space. Yeah, there's something about space. They could be into something. Um, yeah, they they believe in aliens. They believe in you know something. True love. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, this is definitely someone uh, who want to tell you about their feelings. You could be mirroring this person. Color red could be important here. Here. This is the energy, so they definitely want to tell you they're in the energy of true love. They feel like you're their true love. So this is definitely someone who wants to maybe confess their feelings to you or they want to tell you that they're in love with you. This could be a confession coming or the truth is coming out from this person. Like they maybe want to heal the situation between you and them. Yes, we have the writer. Number one could be important. Four, 14 could be important. This person could be born onto any month of one, four or 14. Their age could be 40 plus or 41. Literally, this could be a confirmation for you. Now, we have the rider. Definitely, this is a rider. So, they could be into um, horse riding. They could be into your yeah, rainbow. This could be a rainbow tribe couple if you are into that. Um, the rider is also talking about taking action and she's holding the letter here. So, this person literally want to talk to you. They want to communicate. They maybe want to tell you about their feelings. They maybe want to tell you that you are the true love. They never felt this type of a connection with anyone. And I think the way this person is in the space, this person is all in their head about you. They could be dreaming about you. They think you are the one. Uh, you are the only one. I think they're falling very head over heels for you and they're already in love with you. They're, they have a lot of love. 
for you. There, there's something about color red here. Definitely, it's it's the love of it's it's definitely the color of red. Color is the passion. It's a desire. It's about love, romance. This person definitely want to take you out. Okay, they maybe want to take you out into. I want to use some other tarot deck here to see what's going on between you and this person. Okay, we will see. We will see. So I think, yes, as far as I am seeing, this person definitely has feelings for you already. They have a lot of love for you. They're going to take action. Let's see who wants to talk to you. This could be a letter, important letter or important news or confession coming, conversation coming. Let's see who wants to talk to you. Oh, yeah, King of Pentacles. Um, I'm also feeling this person could have, um, you really make this person so happy. This person really likes you. It's like a wish come true. Are you or this person wish come true? King of Pentacles, this person could have art placements like Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Yes, this is that person who's very stable. This person is definitely uh, could be living in the big city or big places or big areas. Or they want to take you somewhere. Wine and dine you, I'm hearing. This person believe in luxury. They could be living in the luxury. I think this person has money. They are successful. They could be a business owner. Are they definitely some type of position of authority? Or they are successful, by the way, the king of pentacles. Now, this is someone who's very stable, okay? They're not just coming for to waste your time, okay? Now, some of you, this could be a letter coming, appointment letter coming, okay, with the ace of swords. Like, you're going to work with this person. Because king of pentacles, this person is bringing some type of offer to you. Like, you're going to work with this person. So this could be um, some type of a letter, appointment letter, uh, communication, like you, you're selected, this type of a news, okay? It's, it could be work-related, and others of you is the romance, because we have a true love. Let's see. Um, letter K could be important here. Two of Wands, yes, this person definitely, they could be live far away from you, or they're planning ahead. Two of Wands, they're definitely planning how, they have, they, how they're gonna tell you. You're definitely in this person's mind. They want to communicate with you. They want to tell you how do they feel. Uh, nine of Wands. Some of you, this person could age could be 29. You could be also seeing number 11 a lot. One, one. So this could be a message for you. Uh, now we have a two of Wands and nine of Wands. This is also someone, some of you, this could be at a workplace maybe. This is someone who you're working together as a senior, as a boss, as a, you know, something. Maybe you're working under this person. This person may be, okay, so some of you, it's uh, work related. They want to help you. They're going to bring some type of news to you that's going to help you to get out of this um, situation that you're stuck in. They're going to bring some type of a financial good news and abundance for you. And others of you, this is someone um, who wants to be with you, but they either you are defensive toward this person or they are defensive, so they're going to let down their guards. I'm strongly feeling the aeroplane here, so this person could be definitely going to travel to see you or meet you. Are they want to travel with you somewhere? They want to take you somewhere so that that's where they're going to confess their feelings. That could be the energy here. Now let's see more. Yeah, four of pentacles. Yes, this person is definitely going crazy. They have been holding for a long time. It's been a long time. This person could have a dyed hair, like they could have a blonde it could be black or it could be brown, dark brown or ginger hair, even red hair. I don't know, girl or guy. Even if this is a woman, she could have blonde or red hair or ginger. Yeah, I think this person is really worried that with the nine of swords, um, it, you could be seeing nine, nine number a lot or four, four. That's a message for you. I think this person is worried with the four of pentacles and nine of swords. Like maybe you're not going to accept their offer. Maybe it's too late. Some of you, maybe it's too late to tell you how do they feel because they have been planning for a long time. This person is also worried about their money and finances. So they could be thinking that they may be not gonna provide you on that level. Some of you, they're working on something, okay? They're not, maybe they're, either they're, it's not like this person does not have money, they have it, but they could be worried about money and finances, some reason. They think that they need to focus on their career because they have a big plans with the two of wands. This person has a big plans. This could be even someone who choose their money, their career over you. And now they're regretting it. They're definitely in a deep regret because you are guarded up now with the nine of wands. So they, they, they're sorry now, but you are this person true love. And they really, 
want to because remember I told you they want to heal things with you they really want to tell you or explain something to you they're really determined to talk to you and they're gonna take action now I, I want to see that this person cannot even sleep at night they're really worried this person is uh, I think overthinker they're also very anxious nervous to approach you to reach out to you or if this is some of you if this is a new person here they're still worried because either it's a long distance or this is someone that who could be really focused and work on their career right now so they cannot afford to be in a relationship but you are their true love it's like it's like a wish come true but they will take action eventually now let's see uh, if they will step up if they will literally do something this person could have a fire placements or air placements too, but I'm strongly feeling earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Ten of Wands, yes, look at this. I think this person will do something or say something. At least they're really feeling a lot of burden and pressure right now. They could also really overwhelmed by the responsibilities with the Ten of Wands. This person is really, really feeling a lot of pressure right now. They're really overwhelmed right now. They don't know how to handle the situation. I think they really want to heal the situation. They really want to make things right. But some of you, this could be someone who's really worried about their money and finances. Like they cannot think about love right now, but you are their true love. Like you are just in front of them and they cannot let you go either. So let's see if they will do something or not. Empress, ooh. This person definitely sees you as a divine feminine, the true love, the love of their life. Um, doesn't matter you're male or female and they feel like they're the they're definitely going to send you a message they will tell you some of you you have a kids with this person some of you you already know who i'm talking about this could be your husband or the father of your kid or mother of your kids because we have empress and the king of pentacle or this is someone that you're going to have kids with because i'm seeing page and the empress this is someone that you're going to have a baby with you are going to have a family with king of pentacle this is a daddy this is someone who's going to be your husband or wife one day could be in the future. Obviously, right now, things are definitely not uh, good between you and this person. This is also someone who give you the headaches. They give you stress. They give you or they hurt you. They disappointed you, I'm hearing. You give up on this person or you guard it up? You're not even allowing this person to come towards you. So this, you can expect an apology from this person, some of you, because I'm seeing they want to heal the situation between you and them. They want to explain. They want to talk. They're feeling a lot of pressure because they know that how you're going to respond is going to be difficult. Now, others of you, if this is a new person here, they literally want to talk to you. They want to get to know you because they could be even trying to um, start something with you. They see the potential in you. They feel like you are their true love and empress, like you are the one that they, they want to have a kids with. They want to have a future with. They want to have everything all with you. But they are mentally not prepared or they're not on that same page right now. Like they somehow they're, they could be afraid to fall in love to lose control because they have a responsibilities or there's something going on here that they're under pressure or feeling burden or tension but they definitely have eyes on you this person even wear glasses they could be noticing what you're doing or what you are up to they're definitely all in their head and all in their they're really dreaming about you and they you really make this person out of this world the way they feel towards you it's out of this world and they maybe want to tell you or something or confess something to you now, some of you, this is, a, I told you, this is for those group of people that who are, you know, it could be work related. So this person definitely sees some type of a, they maybe want to work some type of a creative work with you or they think that they're bringing some type, something uh, potential on the table that you cannot ignore. They maybe want to have some type of a, you know, need your help maybe. Either you're going to help this person or they're going to help you. So that type of opportunity is coming. So this person could also have a Taurus and Libra placements in their chart. This person sees you as a goddess, with the empress, okay? If you're a woman watching this video or female, like you are the ideal partner they're ever looking for. And I think they're already in love. They're already putting you on pedestal. They're already, you know, I think imagining you as the wife, as the kids of their mother and everything all with you. So they think you are the true love. Now, some of you, this person, and you already had made up these all plans, but things did not go well. So they're really feeling a lot of burden and pressure. They cannot even imagine their life without you, whoever this is. It's coming and, and it's going to be with a lot of pressure and burden. This person is going to do a lot of things. They really want to reconcile with you with the Six of Cups. For some of you, it's a reconciliation. They want to heal things. They want to mend things. They want to apologize. But it's up to you if you're going to allow them or not. 
So this is that person who want to talk to you. Now I'm going to move uh, towards some type of uh, letters. So it's going to be give you some double confirmation or something that will come off like city, name, places. I don't know. We will see. Hmm. We have F, um, P, profile picture. Uh, I think this person is watching your pictures. Wait a minute. Okay, and we have a seven, could be eight. We have I, five, V, VIP. So there's something about VIP energy, either you or them, I don't know. N, A. Maybe this person want to F you, okay? They're really physically drawn to you. Yeah, they definitely want to have you, their kids. Or they think, <laughs> they're thinking about that, maybe imagining about you, not in a bad way, okay? I'm saying they really want physically drawn to you. Could be New York, this person could be from New York. Um, places, we have a T, they're getting the T definitely. Could be 10, Nate, Natty. We have O, could be UAE, are you UK? Euro, I don't know, from Europe maybe, from this person, could be India. I'm also saying uh, something about North and East, could be. We have an N, New Zealand, could be for some of you. Net, Internet, Net, A, Ton, Tony, um, Ria, Tina, Nate, Mate. Okay, that's your letters, you can see that. Okay, I'm going to see you on your reading. Bye. See you later. Like, share, and subscribe with the notification bell, and please give me your feedback. Hello, group number two. If you choose this beautiful green crystal, welcome on your reading. We will see who wants to talk to you, who wants to communicate with you, and why. What do they want? Six of swords. Hmm. This is definitely someone who wants uh, to heal the situation with you. We have uh, two kids involved here, either... This is someone that who makes you so happy, your inner child feel connected with this person. Are you really connected with this person, inner child? Are you make them so happy? Some of you, this person wanna take you somewhere, I think. They wanna meet you somewhere. They want to have good memories with you. They wanna go on adventure with you. They wanna go on some type of a fun with you. They wanna take you somewhere. This is, uh, even though it's a six of swords, it's giving me the six of cups energy. It could be soulmates. This is someone from your past or someone who has a crush you have a history with. Okay, we have planning and, uh, and action. Yeah, I think this is someone who want to talk to you. They, they, they live on the distance, by the way. This could be someone who live on the distance, so they're planning because I'm seeing the map. They're planning their move. They're planning how to meet you, how to see you. They're really serious, I think. I'm also feeling with this green here, this person's heart chakra is opening. You open this person's heart chakra, are they open for this connection, let's say, some of you. Number two could be important because the two is number of harmony and balance. And six of swords also talk about healing. So they want to heal the situation between you and them. Or they want to meet you somewhere. They feel like you're very healing for them. They definitely want to take some type of a trip with you. They want to visit some type of a places with you. Or they want to heal themselves with you. They think that you're going to heal them. If you will be as a like partner in crime or... Friends, this could be even platonic, like someone wants to meet you. They want to see you again. They cannot wait to see you again, but this could be even a relationship. Someone want to definitely go somewhere with you. Only you and them. <laughs> okay, let's see. They maybe want to invite you somewhere. Oh, yeah. So their age could be 26 or 27. Some of you, not for everyone. The letter, and we also have the bottom of the deck woman holding a bouquet so yeah the rose sorry so this person definitely seeing you in in a romantic way it's definitely a message coming a letter coming this person also going to write you a letter a message or maybe confession that will give you some type of a direction of this connection that's going to be some of you it's a closure could be 29 of this person age um Within the two weeks or two months, I think this person is definitely going to do it. Maybe in this month, uh, they're on the date of 27 could be important, or 29. They're going to do it. They're going to send you a message. We also have a seven of swords. I think they really want to explain something to you. 
this message or this, this I think this is going to be a long paragraph, a long message. So when they are email or text, whatever it is, okay, uh, it's a very important document or they may be going to, uh, some of you are picking up, they're going to send you important uh, pictures or messages that's going to reveal something to you. They even going to tell you that even they're going to send you some type of a location, a place and, and like we are meeting there or I want to meet you this place or this, this, this where, somewhere like this. It's going to be very clear and very direct message from this person that you're not going to doubt it. Now, some of you, this could be even a workplace, like someone maybe wants to meet you and you know, you will go there because of an interview, a job, I think. So because they will send you location or they will tell you that this place, you need to come there. But this could be also like someone wants to meet you and this is going to be, they're going to send you, I'm, str I'm strongly feeling they're going to send you a location and place. Location of that place. And they're going to also tell you that we should meet there. I want to meet you there. Or we should meet there. Like something like that. I don't know. That's, that's the energy coming here. This person wants to meet you. They're going to send you some type of a link maybe. It's going to be uh, because if you will follow that, you will be there. They're going to also send you something like um, important number, important link, important place, important some. There's something uh, important coming from this person. It's going to be like you have to follow it and you will be there to talk to this person or to meet them. That's what I'm feeling from this person energy. Let's see. Uh, who wants to talk to you? Who wants to communicate with you? Two of swords. Yes, this is someone who's definitely on the crossroad. Maybe you don't see this message coming. You don't see. Um, yeah, it's going to be unexpected and sudden. You will also maybe think when this person is going to send you a message, you will be unsure of it. Because you will be like, I don't know. Um, should I go and meet this person? Should I talk to them? Or should I choose this offer? This, this whatever it is. Three of Wands, yes, it's definitely someone live far away from you. There's a distance because I'm seeing the map and location. Either it's a short distance because three to six hour distance, maybe location like you have to meet. Um, or this could be a long distance across the bodies of the water. Like there's definitely living in a different country. So they definitely, maybe that's why they're not sure how to meet you, how to see you and how to talk to you. But they definitely have a plan. Look, the message coming, Page of Pentacles. They definitely have a plan. Are they going to send you a message? This person sees the potential. This person, you can also expect an apology from this person because I'm feeling this is someone who wants to, exp uh, you know, explain something to you. And when when this you will receive this message, this explanation or this whatever it is, it's going to give you the direction of this connection with this person. And I think you will heal it, or either it's a closure for both of you. But I think you will heal the situation. This is going to make sense. A lot of clarity will come to you about this connection about this person. And you will know the direction where this relationship is heading. Yeah, this person could be an earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Could be younger than you. Because I'm seeing childlike energy in this person. It's four of Cups. Yes, this person could be um, also that person who maybe think that they have a fear of rejection. They, they definitely know that. That it's not easy. Uh, to talk to you uh, maybe they have a fear of rejection or they may be this is also someone with the over it the way this person's shirt is written you know that letters over it so this could be someone that you're over it and now they are coming back to you so maybe it's too late for this person to plan this message or to send you this message um, or this is someone that who maybe have um, you know anxiety or tension or they're really worried that you're not going to accept their offer or message or apology whatever it is coming now let's see who is this person more because i think i want to get to know them more king of Swords. yes this is definitely someone who is an air sign placement gemini libra aquarius with a fire we have a lot of uh, a lot of things but i think this person have a definitely earth and air placements in their chart this person's heartbroken Interesting. I think you have a two people who will reach out to you. The hermit. This is someone who ghosted you. They could also have a fire and air placements in their chart. Fire and air. Interesting. You have a two people here. Or maybe this is the same person. Now this person could have a Virgo. 
Definitely Virgo. We also have a fire, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Very prominent, very... You definitely have a more than... Maybe you have a three of swords, like three people here who are literally approaching you. Maybe that's why you will be confused because I, you will be not sure how to approach them or how to accept their offer because I think... I think you have options, pile number two. You have a people coming to you or want to talk to you. Now, there is someone definitely coming with an apology. This is um, someone who ghosted you. They rejected you or you feel rejected or ignored by this person. They definitely want to talk to you. They, they're sorry. They maybe want to explain things. This is also someone who's very attractive and charming. They're very good looking. So they maybe thought the grass is greener or maybe they did not understand your value, your worth when you were there. Now they really understand that because you're not there. You maybe stop talking to them. There's something happened between you and this person, okay? Now there is another person here with the king of swords and three of swords, okay? This is someone who is a heartbreaker or they're right now heartbroken. So they maybe need your some type of a help or guidance or they may be seeing you as like they also have eyes on you. Or this could be the same person who broke your heart. This is a heartbreaker, by the way, whoever this is. They are a heartbreaker, but their heart is broken now because they want to heal the situation. This is definitely someone who broke your heart. Um, they rejected you. They ignored you. They were keep, uh, I think, tab putting the tabs on you. They're watching you, everything all, but they never make the move. They never told you how do they feel. They're playing the games. They really make you, it's like indecisive about this connection. This is like someone with a two of swords also like, was giving you mixed signals. They never tell you the true, um, their intentions are feeling, but it's coming. This person is ready to maybe talk, but we will see if they will step up or not. Um, but I'm also feeling there could be a two people here right now who want to talk to you, who want to get to know you, or they're going to send you a message. Um, this could be the same person maybe, okay? Like, I don't want to repeat myself again and again, but I think there's a three people here. Earth sign, fire sign, and what air. Or maybe this person has these three very heavy earth, fire, and air placements in the chart. This is also someone who's uh, very cold and detached. They were very cold and detached towards you. They said harsh things to you. Or you said harsh things to them. There's definitely some type of a drama involved here. This person really honored themselves, I think. They definitely have some type of a creative. They're very artistic. They could be have a power, authority, position. They're very cold and detached. I think this is not the person that who easily allow people in. But there's something about your connection here. I told you, like you really connected with this person and you really heal them. And that's why they want to get close to you. But they're really spying on you or checking on you. Some of you, this is the same person coming back from the past. And some of you, this is a new person here. So you have a two people here. One person is a new person, but they're broken. But they feel somehow like you you have the healing energy. They see the potential with you. They see, that, see the future with you. So some of you, you're going to take your time. Look, the hangman, the two of swords. You're going to take your time. I think you have an option. So let's see. If they, will, if they will step up or not, whoever these people are. Could be Pisces. You could be seeing butterflies a lot. There's a moon energy here. Let's see. If they will step up or not. These people will step up or not. Queen of Pentacles. Interesting. Ten of Pentacles. This person, whoever these people are, they know that you are a wifey material. If you're a woman watching this video. You're a wifey material. You're a husband material. You're looking for something serious. You're not here to play. This person knows that now. They maybe want to settle down with you. This person is planning. Uh, they maybe want to move in together with you, some of you. This person even serious that they want to meet your family or their family. Like they really, they really want to introduce you to their family. This person is serious. Seven of Pentacles. I think they're waiting, patiently waiting for the right time to make a move because they know that you are looking for something serious. You're not, you're not here to play. The sun. I think yes, some of you yes, um, okay, the sun and the five of swords, some of you this person is still in their ego and pride, they could have a Leo placement and a lot of earth, you can see that, you could be earth sign, they could be fire and air, you can see that how this person is still sitting in their ego and pride, they're heartbroken, they're crying, but they're not going to admit it, because their ego, their pride in the way, five of swords and the sun. This is also someone. Only you make this person so happy. 
that's the very also very clear energy here like only you make this person so happy only you the sun god they're happy only with you and they have this cold detached face and there's you know like this this uh, face to other people but there's something about you like they become so happy like childish or uh, they show their true self authentic self in front of you you make them so happy there's something about your energy but they're not going to admit it because of their ego and pride so this person want to tell you okay i think they're giving you hints they're dropping the hints um they may be passing the smile on you when they have a very bitchy face on the poker face on their face with other people okay they don't give a i'm hearing this person don't give a damn to anyone whoever this is with the king of wands and king of swords you can see that maybe you have a two people because they both don't give a damn to anyone but there's connection here with you because i think you both have you you have a soul contract with these two people if this is a two people or three you have a soul contract with people you have this energy there is energy about you like you're very happy go lucky and free spirited so people definitely let down their guards okay these people does not give a damn to anyone but there's something about your energy like they really want to let down their guards and they want to be with you they maybe want to enjoy with you or they maybe want to heal the situation with you so if this is someone who don't give a damn to anyone they give a damn to you <laughs> it's so cute yeah look at this queen of swords because you are the queen you know you you're telling this person okay i think you you're telling this person like okay come to me now i will i will show you who i am then so i think you have two sides this person know that you have two sides and they also have a duality to them by the way we have the queen of pentacles so this could be someone who's seeing you very nurturing very loving but with them you are also this person seeing you like you are smart so you're the full package this person knows that and that's why they want to marry you look the hierophant marry you so i think they're going to take the time but it's going to be shocking and surprising with the tower whenever it's going to happen it's going to be a surprise it's going to be unexpected and sudden some of you you will be surprised that whoever this person is who want to talk to you you will be shocked and surprised i strongly feel you have a two people or more than two people coming your way but you have to decide i think you will choose this person this king of swords who who definitely going to match with your energy you will have a chemistry together you will have a mental understanding with this person there's a but this person who broke your heart or they disappointed you you're not going to choose them and it's going to be shocking and surprising for this person because they're very attractive and charming 30 could be the age here of this person we also have a 20 30 23 uh we have a u w whoever you're not going to pick they're going to be they're going to definitely piss off but they're also going to be very surprised shock we have a n e t net could be something net 10 letter yeah letter coming definitely m gm this person going to send you a message maybe 8 t mega <laughs> something mega coming big something big coming kite kg lg i don't know gm gym maybe you will meet this person gym or they they going to gym met met time it's it's just definitely the matter of the time time difference could be there also so that's your reading like and subscribe i'm going to see you later bye god bless you all please give me the thumbs up subscribe and hit the notification bell and give me your feedback hello group number 3 welcome if you choose this beautiful white heart welcome on your reading who want to talk to you the message letter communication call coming from that person who want to talk to you and why by the way i just noticed that your time stamp is 3333 and this is a three pile number 3 so definitely number 3 is important 3333 if you add it like 15 12 could be important 369 9. these numbers are very important so let's see who want to talk to you we have a emperor oh daddy and then we have the page of cups Yeah this is definitely someone who could be into sports fitness i can see that this person has a definitely well multiple hobbies and activities this person could be a sportsman or woman but this is a masculine energy with the emperor here with the page of cups this person could be already a father with the emperor they could already a father or they will be a good father or they want to be a father i don't know could be the father of your kids already some of you this could be the father of your kids you already have a kid with this person 
and this person is already a father of kids or mother of kids. I don't know. This is a mother, a father energy with the emperor. Now, the emperor is also some of you, your boss, like someone that who wants to talk to you, want to give you some type of a gift, reward, or want to take you somewhere. Could be. Page of Cups is like very, this person could be, okay. Some of you, this person is like very buffy and very like um, buff man, like big man. Yeah, it's giving me the vibe of song of big man. I want a big man. Give me a big man. Big boy, sorry, big boy, right? Big boy. I want a big boy, big boy. That song, it's coming in my mind. So this person is like come, literally come off like very hard and tough. And rough on outside but they're very uh, shy reserved and playful uh, they're very romantic are you are bringing this romantic side to them with a page of cups like they're very shy <laughs> oh and this is so cute like uh, this person is very rough and tough in front of the world like everybody will know that they could be even a weightlifter they could be into sports they could be into um, they, they could be gym freak I think they're very masculine. They could be into army, police, like some type of a, a very, um, you know, tough job, tough places. But this person is a page of cups. Like they're very shy, reserved, and romantic. They, they're very softy. <laughs> oh my god, I like it. I like who this person is. Like they're very softy. Or you bring the soft side in this person. And this is also it's like a fish catching the fish so this person's think that um, you are the big fish you cat you you catch the fish okay they're trying to get your attention i'm also feeling pick me choose me love me that type of energy coming from this person they could be trying to get your attention by by being playful to getting out of their comfort zone because they're not this type of a person um could be a pisces and we also have an aries energy very strong here but let's see capricorn could be scorpio this person has a duality. They have a two sides, okay? Now, let's see who want to talk to you. Yes, look at this. We have the loving man. Yeah. They want to show you their this side. They want to show you their loving side, their nurturing, caring side. Maybe you, you know them in this way. They, they maybe want to ask you out because it's a bouquet. So they maybe want to ask you out for a dating, but they're very nervous. They're very shy. They're very reserved. They don't know how to... Number five is, is bringing change. It's a people. So definitely want to show you their romantic side. Or they want to show you their loving side. Because I think you you maybe misunderstood them. Or you maybe don't know that they're softy. Or you make them vulnerable. Okay, I think that's the energy. This person definitely want to ask you out. Or want to give you some type of a gift. Bouquet could be a flower coming. An invitation coming also. Yeah, number six could be um, the clouds here. So this person is definitely, you have, you definitely have some type of a cloudy judgment about this person. Number six, we also have a king of wands here, right? So this person could be Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, strongly Aries, could be Leo, um, could be uh, Sagittarius. I'm also picking up um, Taurus energy maybe. Number 11 could be important. So divine counterpart, Emperor is a divine masculine. This person could have a letter K in their chart, sorry, in their name. Number six could be important. The month of June and May is important here. Maybe you met this person there. We have a cloudy. So it's like they really is the, like, um, they want to show you their true side. I think you really misjudged them, misunderstood them. Um, there's a misunderstanding and miscommunication happen. Some type of uh, endings between you and this person. And they want to show you their true side. Like they want to show you like, this is me. This is who I am. I think I'm going to use this, this deck now. Hmm. so this is that person they could be also not uh, sure about it like how to communicate with you how to how to get your attention how to clear this misunderstanding between you and them or something happened between you and this person right now this is also someone who's really trying very hard to get your attention and they think you're not seeing them in that way you're not looking at them you're not seeing them very clearly you're definitely not seeing them. There's a clouds here. So they could be confused uh, about this connection. They're confused how to get your attention, how to be there for you. They may be not sure how you're going to respond if they will come or step up. This is definitely a romantic offer. And those of you, this is a work. It could be a boss or it could be the father of your kids. Okay. Who not sure to approach you, like how make things right with you. 
and if you're currently dating someone or you have a crush on someone this could be someone that maybe you have a chance and potential if you will step up if you will let this person know that you have feelings too if you know what i'm talking about like they're very tough and rough but they're they're very softy but let's see uh who is this person want to talk to you two of swords yes more confusion they're not sure about it you don't see them you're not seeing them you're not seeing them two of swords and the the clouds coming up together you're not seeing them or maybe you don't see them in that way the way they they're looking at you you also have no idea about this person's feelings maybe they never told you uh, i'm seeing this person could be libra they have a libra placements or you could have a libra placements yes of pentacles yes this some of you this is a new person or they want a new beginning with you now ace of pentacle also work related so maybe you don't see this offer coming okay from this person maybe this could be a work offer coming okay we have a king of wands yes this is definitely a fire sign you're not seeing them aries leo sagittarius king of wands king of wands twice i mean so double confirmation this person has a fire placement fire fiery this is a fiery person they could have a leo look at the lion lion aries they're very rough and tough i'm telling you this is a very passionate person they're very ambitious uh they're very ambitious you maybe really not see them in that way you think oh my god this is not my type they're very they could be very um masculine or they come off like they, they definitely have a soft and romantic side but you're not seeing them are you not seeing them in that way maybe in a romantic sense the way they are looking at you this person really wants a new beginning or this is a new person this is a new person in your life but you're not looking in, the, in that way in them two of pentacles yes this could be someone that you're juggling you're like okay we will see yeah i think you will when they will step up or they will tell you you will be like okay we will see i think you look disinterested in this person with a two two you could be seeing two two number a lot but they have a eyes on you like they they could have a dark skin they could also have a tattoos on their body they're very determined by the way they are determined let's see who is this person they definitely have, they could have a earth air and fire placements in their chart oh yeah this person is serious the empress and nine of wands this person knows that you're guarded up they know you're beautiful wow this person definitely sees you as a wife you material now interesting we have a emperor and empress i mean come on i cannot make this up emperor and empress this is a two different deck by the way so yeah divine counterpart so this is your soulmate a twin flame uh, maybe you are not seeing them in this way you're guarded up you're really working on yourself you're working on your healing you're working on your uh, energy you may be guarded up you may be make the boundaries with this person you're like no because this person was giving you mixed signals with this uh, cloudy energy here are you just misunderstood them you just misjudged them are there something between you and this person happened that it's like things did not go well or they were giving you mixed signals because i think this is someone who's very uh, they have a duality like they they did not show you this side but now they want to look this person really wants a new beginning or this is a new person here you maybe met this person one month ago or one year approximately or two years you know them maybe to a pentacle this is someone who's definitely maybe they were keep juggling you they were keep making you confused they were also were not ready or not available when you were in their life they were really focused on other things maybe because i'm seeing this person is a workaholic they're driven by their passion their work um they could be very busy busy type of a person now with the empress and nine of wands this person really really uh, sees you as the one they see you as a pride they also put you on pedestal by the way they know they're you're guarded up they know maybe you have options now let's see if they will step up or not this person sees you very motherly like you, i told you you bring this person soft side you maybe have already kids with this person i'm telling you because we, i told you this could be someone who's with the father of your kids so you may be already mother of this person child uh or and this person definitely sees you as the mother of their child like they think that you have a future they think you are the one but you're not seeing them in that way or maybe uh there's something happen that this person did not see you in that way when you were available in this person life let's see if they will um if this is a new person they definitely have eyes on you and they think you are the one 
Now let's see if they will step up or not. Judgment, they will. It's like they're feeling the urge to talk to you. They're feeling the urge. They're feeling, it's like they're getting all the signs from the universe. Like, do it. Say it. You are the one. I think universe is guiding them. They want to tell you the truth. You could be even uh, feeling this person's our presence energy a lot. Um, you could be really spiritually connected with this person on a soul level. You can feel this person energy so strongly. Yeah, I think this is a soul tie between you and this person. It's definitely divine counterpart, soul mates, twin flames, whatever you believe. It's definitely a soul um, soul tie between you and this person. Three of Pentacles. I think yes, they want to get to know you. They want to get close to you. If something never happened, they will. Six of Wands, yes, they will. Next three to six days or months or weeks, some of you. They will. This person really want to get to know you. They want to get close to you. But the work could be in the way between you and this person. I, I strongly feel this person's work in the way. They could be in a public eye. You could be in a public eye. Does not have to be. You've got this person's attention. Ace of Cups, yes. Ace of Cups and Ace of Pentacles. This person definitely sees you as the one. They're falling in love. They are in love. Now, some of you, this could be at a workplace. I told you, like, this person maybe wants to give you some type of a success, promotion, success. They maybe want to meet you. They maybe going to give you some type of a project that you're going to collaborate with someone and it's going to bring you a lot of success. This could be even a position because your hard work is definitely going to pay off. And your boss or the, this person, whoever that you're in a business partnership with, is going to give you this um, new opportunity to prove yourself. Some of you, this could be even a, a new offer coming of job, a collaboration with someone that's going to bring you more success. Now, if this is someone like ex-husband or wife or someone that you have kids with, they definitely want to bring a new opportunity here, but you have definitely a choice to be with them or not. But they feel the urge to be with you. And, and because we were talking about if they will step up or not, yes, they will. This person will confess their feelings. They will. They're falling in love, I'm hearing. It's not just love. They're head over heels. They think you're the one. You will be maybe publicly together or officially together. Are they ready to work on this connection? Maybe in the past they were not, but now they're very sure about it. Now let's see this person's letter or anything. We have a M, D, M, M, G, G, M, 5, could be I, Mig, or Mega, Jim, O, L, Y, L, A, L, A maybe important here, 9, 5 could be important, 5 to 9. The job maybe this person, yeah, this person is five to nine job, doing nine to five job, or you are doing that, you have a seven. They're always busy, I think. C, A, L, could be California, L, Canada. I'm hearing L, A, Lake. We have a G, A, okay. Some of you, this person could be um, Rainbow Tribe. Okay, you can see the letters here. P, A, take, tag, or they're gonna tag you in something or they will tag something, they are tagging something. River, Europe, tiger. They could be born into tiger year of Chinese or it could be lion, I'm also feeling because we already have it. A lion spirit, a tiger spirit. We have a gate. Gate is opening. Are they going to open up to you? So that's your letter, letters and that's your numbers. Like, share and subscribe. I'm going to see you later. Bye. Give me your feedback. Hello, group number four. The last one. Finally, if you choose this chocolate color. So this person could have loved chocolate or there's something about chocolate color. Chocolate hair, dark brown, dark brown on eyes. I don't know. Something about chocolate. So let's see who wants to talk to you and why. We have a Knight of Pentacles and we have, yeah, and we have a Nine of Swords. So this person is definitely, they could have a dark skin complexion than you, tan skin, darker complexion than you. Now I'm feeling, feeling whoever this is, they have been very slow. And Nine of Swords is also like, this is someone who's worried. They're very nervous, by the way. It's like they're almost peeing. Look at this. They're peeing there. They're nervous. <laughs> You make them nervous, whoever this is. You make them so nervous to approach you, to contact you, to be there for you. They could be earth sign, by the way. Our air placements are an earth and air. 
here you go back and forth yes back and forth and conflict so this is someone that you're to conflict with and they're back and forth should i approach them should i not should i approach them should i not should i approach them should i not should i tell them not should i message them not should i this person is nervous whoever this is and the, it's very funny the way they're being okay like they're very nervous look at this back and forth conflict you have a conflict with this person you could be 30 plus 40 plus or 50 plus or this person could be yeah, you had a conflict with this person. It's very, it's very prominent. And they don't know how to approach you. You definitely had a fight and conflict with this person. Or this could be someone who wants to approach you, but they, know, they don't know if they will approach you, then there will be a lot of drama will be created. Or how you will be going to react on them. This is very uh, someone who's very nervous. Like they're almost... Yeah, cross. Look at this. They could be Christian. Some of you, this person is a Christian. They could live in the uh, in a different place than you. Maybe that's why they they think I don't know. They're nervous. I think they think you will get angry or you will not understand them. The cross is very difficult for this person to approach you. They don't know how to explain it. They could even born into a snake here of Chinese. That's a double. Th that's a confirmation for you. Now I'm seeing with the cross because we know that cross is of like, they could be Christian or there's something about, this connection is very spiritual, it's very tough, it's very difficult, it's not easy for this person um, to explain. Their age could be 36, number 6 is important, 4, 5, 6. They could be going through some dark night of a soul. This person does not know how to explain it. They could be taking some type of a help from other people. This is also talking about breaking the law, I'm feeling. They need to break the law here in order to be with you, in order to contact you. It's like they're going to break the law. And that's where they could be very uh, nervous. Hmm. Interesting. It's very tough and difficult for this person, I think. They're having a very difficult time to talk to you, to contact you. Now, this could be also someone who needs your help, maybe financial help, or maybe someone that uh, they, they, they're going through some type of a difficult time and they think that you can, heal them, you can help them, you can heal them, you can give them some type of a guidance because we have a cross. They think that only you can help them, only you can guide them, only you can heal them because, yes, or, or you can give them some type of a guidance to get out of this situation that they are in some type of a, I think they're stuck in some type of a situation that, they, they, they want to get out, some of you, and others of you, this is someone that you had a conflict with. Now, let's see who is this person. Now, with the star here, in, this is cross. It's also talking about soulmate. So maybe this is someone that you had a soul tie with. It's very, it's very challenging and complicated relationship here with this person. There's, there, this is like intentions and events. Intentions is like they're back and forth. They're not sure about it. But the event is also conflict. Like this is someone that you had a conflict with and they're worried about it. They're really overthinking about the situation a lot again and again, back and forth. They're going about that even th that situation that happened between you and them. And it's really, they could be going through a dark night of a soul right now. And they need your help. Ace of Swords, yes. Ace of Swords, look at this again. It's like they want a clarity. They want to tell you the truth or they, they think you know something that you can help them. They think that you are a deep thinker. You're very uh, spiritual. You could be very like a healer energy. You, this is also someone that you, you can see through them and they're really, they're really worried. Like <laughs> you will see through them. Page of Wands. Yes, this could be a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sag. They want to talk to you. They really want to talk to you. You make them so excited. You make them so happy. You, you understand them maybe. They are trying to understand you also. I'm feeling whoever this person is, they're really trying to understand you, like what's going on in your head, what you're thinking about them. Justice. Could be Libra. You can expect an apology or communication from this person. Ten of Pentacles. Some of you, this is a family member that you had a fight and conflict with. Could be your mother. Could be a female person in your family that you're a very like very conflicted situation with some type of a bad event happened bad words harsh words said to each other um some of you i'm feeling this is also someone who abused you uh, maybe emotionally mentally or spiritually 
Like they could be even put the gossips and rumors about you and now they're getting their karma. So whoever this is, they're getting their karma. They're sorry for what they did. So they maybe want to apologize about it or they maybe want to apologize um, what they said to you or what they did to you. If this is a family member, they really need your help. Maybe you're financially stable and they want your help. They need your help. I told you with the justice and the cross here, this could be something to do with legal here. This could be someone that um, who is legally involved with you or they're legally involved in something. So, or they need some type of a legal information about you or let's say they, they, they want some type of a legal um, help from you. They think you're gonna help them. You could be a lawyer or this person could be a lawyer. So they maybe want your advice or need your advice for some of you. Or this could be literally your lawyer um, or something to do with the property or family or money. It's not. We have a two of cups. Okay, so some of you, this is romantic. This could be um, soulmate energy here. Yeah, it's very complex, complicated. This person, this person and you have a soul contract. It's very tied. It's like your souls are very ties to each other. It's very complicated. It's very intertwined. Okay, it's also very intense. I can see that. Now with the justice, is also like karma between you and this person. It's a karmic soul contract. We have a karma. Obviously, it's a good uh, karma. In this energy, I can see that it's a good karma. This could be someone that you just recently met. So they're really conflicted about it because they need to break the rule. And they're really worried how it's going to happen. You could be different. You could have a coming from a different background and culture and religion. This person could have a status. Uh, they're well-known in community or you are well-known in your community. Um, they could be little, they definitely a younger fire sign or air sign because we have a knight of pentacles and page of wands. So they could have a fire and earth in their chart, but they're back and forth. Should they trust you? Should they not? Because they know that it's going to create a lot of mess in their life. And, and they're bounded by some type of a rule or discipline, tradition, culture, because they cannot break it. And you are making them to get out of their comfort zone to break the rule. It's something I'm picking up, I'm channeling the energy of temptation, unconventional, taboo type of relationship. It's not easy. Now, if it's romantic, okay? And others of you, this is someone that who you had a family with. So they really want to maybe um, mend things with you because they really want to reunite with you, your family member or anyone that you had a conflict with, relatives, I don't know. Now, this could be also like property matters, um, legal things involved between you and this person. So your lawyer can want to reach out to you, want to talk to you. You could be even going to sign a contract with someone, a business partnership that's going to bring you more money. But the, this person is showing up very clearly, Knight of Pentacles and Page of Wands. So either it's the two people, one maybe want to apologize, one could be new person. Or this is, or this could be the same person, Two of Cups, they want a union with you. And this, this is definitely with the Ten of Pentacles is giving me the soul tribe. So this is someone from your soul family, it's a soul tribe. You have a soul man, this is a soul man. You have a soul contract with this person um, or you have a soul family. This is someone from your soulmate, okay? Either romantic, platonic. This is your soulmate. You're meant to be with this person. You're meant to have a family, create a family, kids with this person. Some of you, it's like it's going to be marriage, legal marriage between you and this person or legal contract. Yes, yeah, so, so this could be a new person here, but let's see if, if they will step up. Yeah, I'm feeling this person could have a Libra, fire, air, and earth placements. Could be water, but... These signs are very important. Emperor, ooh, daddy. Aries energy here, could be Capricorn, could be Taurus. This person is definitely darker complexion than you. They could be even uh, older than you for some of you. Are you older than this person? There's an age gap here. Now with the Emperor here and the Ten of Pentacles, this person really wanna be a daddy. They wanna be a father. They, wanna, they want to have kids, they want to have a family and they see something in you. They think you are the one. So they will step up. This could be even a boss. Someone could be a well-known person in their community. They have a power. They have a position. <laughs> Seven of Pentacles and King of Cups. Yes, I think. They're thinking about you. They're waiting for the right time to make the move. King of Cups. This person has emotions and feelings. But some of you, they don't have it yet, but they will. Because I think they're very, uh, King of Cups and the Seven of Pentacles, this person is very mature emotionally, okay? They believe in family, they believe in connections, they believe in soulmate, and they're looking for and waiting for the right person, and I think that's you. 
some of you your spirit guides are trying to con connect with you with this person so sooner or sooner or later i think this person will be entered in your life or you will get the clarity who is your soulmate or this person will get very clearly that you are the one and you're coming into union with this person but there's a difference between you and this person either you need to get a clarity or this person need to get a clarity they need to open their eyes it's the third chakra okay like they need to listen to their intuition so let's see if they'll if they will step up three of cups Yes, I think they want to start, this will be start as a friendship. This could be even a friend, okay? From friends to lovers, I'm picking up. This, this is going to start as a friends, lovers, partners. So it's giving me twin flame vibes or soulmates. But definitely divine counterpart, you have a soul contact. This is someone from your soul tribe, soul family. Now, three of cups also reunion between um, families, members, friends, okay? Whoever this person is, they want to talk to you. Could be the father of kids. You have a family with this person already. Or they want to have a family with you. Three of Swords, interesting. This person is heartbroken. There could be a third party, to be honest. I'm not going to lie. This, this, this could be interference of the friends and family. There will be a lot of issues. Are there, there were issues in the past. So they're worried their family and friends, what they will think. Not in a bad way. Like they, they know that because it's a difficult thing here. This is also someone who could be regretting, okay? Because I'm saying that this could be an apology coming. So they're regretting because they listen to their friends and family. They listen to the other people and they're regretting it. They're definitely in a deep regret because you are the one and they did not see you. They did not choose you. They did not trust you. And others of you, this is a new person. This is someone new. They're heartbroken already, okay? They're heartbroken already. So they, they're looking for the one. They're looking for their soulmate and that's you. They will know it very soon or you will know it very soon. Yeah, Eight of Pentacles. So I think they will. Some of you, this is a work situation, okay? This could be your boss or this could be someone that wants to work with you. Uh, maybe they, they're going to help you some type to work to show you that um, they're going to give you a platform that you, where you're going to be showing your true um, authentic self. Um, this could be even someone, uh, I told you, like from family or anyone that who needs your help. This could be even a collaboration coming. This person maybe wants to collaborate with you. They're going to give you a platform that you're going to show your... Signing a contract, basically. You're going to sign a legal contract, a deal with this person. This person is going to help you to show you your true uh, authentic self uh, to your creative side. You will also work with this person a lot, maybe as a partner, as a lover. Um, or this could be something about friendship or reunion, okay, or the, someone, that wants to work, someone who wants to maybe uh, heal the situation between you and them. So they will step up, I think. They want to work on this. They want to heal the situation. This could be even a reconciliation with someone. Because I told you, back and forth and intentions. Nine of Cups and Ace of Pentacles. Yes, they will. They will step up. And they will step up and this is like a wish come true. It's like a wish come true. You will be in the air. You will be the happiest person in the world on that day. It's going to be like you're winning the lottery. Whenever this offer, this, this person, this situation, or this, this big opportunity coming your way. It's, it's written in your destiny with the star card, with the cross here. It's written in your destiny. This person is written in your destiny. Okay, that's your reading. I'm going to see you later. No, we are not leaving because I'm going to show you, you know, this person uh, letters. It's a confirmation. So let's see. Okay, we have a three. 30 could be important here. We also have a F. Could be V. P, profile picture, VP, VIP, I don't know. We have a 5, could be important here. 30, 50, 35. We also have a W. We have L. We also have LA, could be important here. We have a D, deal. Long distance, I'm hearing. Y, lady. This person will treat you like a lady if you're a lady or this is a lady who's approaching you, a female coming into your life. We have a uh, teddy, maybe teddy is important. Date, yeah, date, D-A-T-E, date. There will be a date. I think this person will date you. We have a W, they want to date you or you will go on a date with this person. We have a pet, maybe something to do with the pets. PG, ooh, this person is definitely going crazy. 
and they will do some stuff with you. We have a van or win. It's going to be win. You're going to win. And it, this could be any letter, by the way. Here. Pen could be. They're going to write something to you. So that's your uh, reading. That's your letters. Like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to see you later. Bye. God bless you all.